Okay, part two of my computers. Okay, so this is down in the basement still. And, you know, I'm talking about more stuff. Here's that case, the HP case I'm fixing. There's the motherboard with the, um, huh, with the video card in it. This has a pretty good processor on it, I think. So, I right now I was just going to show you what's on the Dell Dimension A200. Oh, it's this. Windows XP and support. Wow. Mm -hmm. This computer is way out of out of date. <clears throat> yeah, some programs on here. Uh, I need to lay the case down for me to use the mouse. I'm using a stupid old ball mouse that's kind of broken. I had to put tape to hold this cover on. That's the mouse ball called. It works still. Control panel. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. It's the only specs of the double dimension and the, the um, gaming PC. Oh, they're still on. It's not really a gaming PC. It's slow. It has one gigabyte. Yep. My name for our processor. 512. Uh, 512 mega, meg. 512. No, I'm not even showing you. I'm going to restart the computer and I'm going to go into the setup. Restart. Restart. Oh. Restart. Then we can look at the specs again. This is the HP. Yeah. This is the Dell Dimension. I accidentally hit the camera. There's this old People PC, Ford Motor Company keyboard. It's an old 98 keyboard. It was designed for 2098. Yeah. Look, Packard. This goes to the old Ford computer that I made. Dad got from his work. No luck. Here's this. Premium. Premio, I think. F2. Yeah. Don't mention the keyboard fail. Keyboard's plugged in. I wonder what keyboard fail means. <laughs> oh, what the heck? I just saw the light come on. The keyboard. <clears throat> yeah, here's the stuff on the... I don't know why this keyboard ain't working now. It's a short in it. I hear sounds in there. It was working earlier. I guess I must get the... F2. Yep, keyboard just turned on. Oh, I hear the dull mention beeping. There it is, set up. It works, yeah. Oh, that's actually correct. April 17th. The time is not right. It's not 12 or 4. It is 2017. Hmm. This is the keyboard num lock on. Off. Okay. Keyboard report error. Auto power on disabled because I don't want it. Remote wake up? That's a. AC power recovery, fast boot on, off. <laughs> we need fast boot on. System event log. I think we need to go on to a different page. Uh, is there any other change on here? Yeah. Yeah, L yeah two, L level 2 cache. BIOS version A01. Service tag. Well, I'm not showing you my service tag. Yeah, 1.7 gigahertz Pentium 4 processor. Don't mention 8200. There we go. Okay, let's exit this. And I'll just disregard any changes. So I kind of messed with some settings, but I, I, I hit cancel the settings and stuff. There's Windows XP again. So, I wish I could get one of my laptops upstairs. I was going to. I was, but didn't really do it. Oh, I was going to show some other stuff. I found a box fan in the trash, too, and it works, too. And there's that motherboard I was talking about. I got this stupid printer over here. It doesn't work. It has no ink. Stupid dust jet. 5440. 5440. Office jet 5440 right here. This doesn't work good. It turns on. Just no ink. Yeah, there's the cardboard box I have there.
better made box. <laughs> Here's my dog's toy. <clears throat> oh, not showing you my product key. <laughs> Here's the back of the HP. Is your this in here? Nope. Well, the, how about the um, gaming PC? Nope. And there's that. I'll go I'll show you. I'm gonna go in the laundry room and show you all the computers I have in there. I only have two, I think. Yeah, the light. Yeah, here's a HP desk jet. And some reason that light flickers sometimes. It's weird. Oh yeah, there's the Asus case. Yeah, I think my dog's coming down the stairs. Here's the HP desk jet, I think. Hold on, I have it written on here. <laughs> kind of HP printer. And there's my dog. There it is. Steam computers. Yeah, desk jet 932C. That's what this printer is 932C. That's Jet 932C, and this is an HP PhotoSmart 3210, doesn't work, Packard Bell Multimedia 213E, and an Office Jet 7310 all in one, and 1990, so often, probably 1995, Asus, there's that Packard Bell monitor and keyboard, and this gateway keyboard, I think that thing's broke, but there's the box of cords. There's the Asus. See, there's nothing inside it. Hmm. There's our really old TV and stuff. Okay. The door's squeaky. Yeah, and I got some stuff over here, too. There's a sharp stereo system. It's hooked up to this Sony one. And here's a karaoke machine. I found these two on the side of the road. They both work. Here's the HP. Um, I think PhotoSmart C300 Magnavox DVD player, and I have another one of those printers, but it's in the laundry room buried. It works. It has ne needs ink. That's all. All the printers I have need ink. Here's a Hoover wind tunnel T model. I think that's about everything. There's a Duracraft fan. So I think that's about it. I have way more. Oh yeah, the reason why I have that box there, cause the case for that computer doesn't have any glass in it. The um, NZ, the gaming PC has no case glass. I took it out and I put it in the gaming PC in my room. There's a Samsung VCR DVD combo and Radio Shack real estate radio stuff. Nothing radio receiver and it has a tuner and stuff in it yeah yeah that's basically it We're down here I don't know oh yeah I'm, I'm having internet